All right, we apologize for the breaking transmission. So where were we? Chinalo. <laughs> Can you say you call yourself Chandler? Wait, I'm Chandler. Chandler. Yes. Okay. <laughs> you, you learn every day. So for so your season, I think your peak season would be usually Valentine, right? Valentine and Christmas. And Christmas. Mm, and yeah. Christmas. Yeah. Yes. Because yes. major holidays. Halloween. Do they do Halloweens here? I think we started we do doing some now. Some we do exactly. Halloween mm. party, mm. but not, not, the, not like the, not the yeah. traditional. Then there's Mary. Hello, Hi. Mary. I love Hello. your hair. Thank you, you look amazing. Thank you. <laughs> so how was work today? Very well, very well. Uh, not so busy day, but good stuff. You know, week. you know your your line of business is is part of why we're having this Talking conversation today because <laughs> i don't know how i'm going to be able to sustain luxury lifestyle <laughs> you know mm. if, if you're not budgeted you can still budget it. right yeah. right it's possible you aim you aspire you know you save up for it absolutely yeah. so except you're very buoyant then you you can then have Splodge. and then you <laughs> you just go all out yeah. all right so today we're discussing spending oh, we saw a very interesting video online i will share that much later and here's what we found as today's quote you can have a master's degree in making money but you will still wind up broke if you have a phd in spending it hi when i saw this uh, quote, it's cold, it hits, it's, it's strong <laughs> it's very strong it's me below the belt <laughs> Wow. Spending it. <laughs> All right, as I mentioned earlier, we stumbled on a video on Instagram of a man showing off how much he had saved after cutting off urgent 2K. In his words, he avoided liabilities and unnecessary transfers, right? And he was, I mean, you could see that there was so much money. We'll show the video much later. So it's our ladies' night out. As you can see already, Chinelo, Mary, uh, uh, Rajaga, and I are discussing the topic impact of unplanned spending on personal finance and we would love to hear your experience or your thoughts about this but first let's quickly go on a break to see what we found in the news All right, thanks for staying with us. You're still watching Ways World Animal Day is celebrated globally every year on October 4th to ensure better standards for animal welfare. Now, World Animal Day 2022 not only educates people about our most endangered species, but also informs us about how to rescue them. Who is the lover of animals here? Mm. I am. Ah, Mary, why are you looking with a straight face? <laughs> um, I'm only trying to love them. I can't so you don't have any pets? No. You don't intend to? Uh, maybe 20 years later. <laughs> so well, that's, that's a no. Old animal. Animal. Uh, but, you know, what's your favorite um, animal? Dogs. Dogs, oh. Okay. I so grew I grew up with dogs. Sorry. I've yes. actually tried having... Sorry. sorry, daddy. Yeah, go ahead. I've actually tried having... Uh, keeping a rabbit. Mm. Didn't work out. Because they were too lonely while I was at work. And they, one died and the next week, sorry, the next one died. Sorry, sorry, sorry. <laughs> sorry. sorry. Is, the, is the weather? <laughs> sorry. sorry. Okay, so um, it's one of those things. So World Animal Day. Hmm. You don't do you have any pets? Uh -uh. Don't cat, rabbit, dog. Mm. Wow. At least they can never do it. I mean, I grew up with dogs. Mm. We also had like chickens. Is mm. that part? <laughs> You know what? <laughs> Let's go to break. I think uh, we need to give uh, what's her name, Mary, a bit of a breather. Yeah. Yeah. You know, some of these things. Just stay with us. We'll be right back. Easy.